<laughs> Hello, my name is Simon. I'm from Indonesia Fitness. This is Svenja and we are going to do a super quick uh, warm-up routine you can do before your fast interval training session. And I know you want to go outside and therefore we are starting directly now with a deep breath in and out. And then we stay stable on one foot. The foot you prefer doesn't matter. We are changing directions either, either way. Start by swinging one foot the other arm swings like in the same rhythm and also try to engage your core try to stand still and tall and if you're standing good then get bigger with the movement try to get higher in front and bring your heel back to your glutes and we do three more two one and then we're switching side change your foot and then we're starting with a slow slow movement small movement and when you're standing good you're getting bigger bigger with your arm bigger with your foot get high up and here again three more high and one good perfect now we're changing the foot again but doing some side swings start slow again try to stay balanced and then we're getting bigger bigger and higher with your foot the arm as you can see goes up again in the same rhythm as the foot and do some great swings <laughs> keep it swinging and then we change this side change the side to the other foot again with slow controlled movement uh, small range of motion and then we get bigger get bigger and higher do it with a lot of move range of motion and three two one perfect great now back again to some like smaller movements with your ankle ankle rockers we go on our toes and on the heels and in this one we try to lift the heel as much up from the ground as possible and in the same way the toes String, try to bring the toes far away from the ground and use the whole foot for the movement perfect three two and one do some little shake out take a deep breath also always important and then we're doing this with a little, little bit more tension to like uh, warm up our calves and the Achilles by starting to lift the heel up from the ground very far bring much tension in and then go slow slow down again and repeat this try to push your big toe into the ground and go down again high up make yourself tall from your upper body and down and then we are going um, faster faster up control down and then we are switching up to some like more whipping movement don't go fully down just stay on your toes and whip up and down so your Achilles gets the tension which it either way will get by running can do some jumps <laughs> perfect and then slow down great next up what I call the lunge matrix we're doing three kinds of lunges to get a full range of motion in our glutes and uh, the hips now we start with uh, one foot going in a deep lunge forward and we repeat the, every direction for five repetitions so two more in front next up same leg we're going for five repetitions to the side move your weight completely to the foot on the side perfect do it dynamically one more and now five repetitions to our, uh, to behind us like in a small rotation so deep down fully weight on the leg that is moving two more and one last perfect now the same with the other leg five lunges forward five four three two one next up five to the side five four three two 
and one more. Perfect, and then the rotation backwards. Five, four, three, two, one. Perfect. Shake your legs out, and as you hear the breathing gets up, so your cardiovascular system is getting ready too. Next up, some reverse lunge into what I call a, a slight small jump. We go down, far back with our foot. The arms are moving uh, like in a sprint position. And then we bring our leg from behind back up with the knee and then go back down again. And we're not only going far back, we're trying to get high with our knee. You can even push your heel away from the ground. Do it explosively. Maybe you come up from the ground for three, two, one. Perfect. Next up, Svenja, what's up? Yeah. Perfect. <laughs> so everybody's getting warm. Now switching aside, go in the deep lunge, far behind, bring your arms in a position like in the sprint and then begin with a slow control movement. Try to get bigger, get faster, more explosive. Bring your heel away from the floor, push yourself up from the ground, try to jump. Four, three, two, one. Perfect, good. Shake out, get your breath back. And now we are bringing the, taking the spine in the, in the movement. Do a little bit slower. We go a little step backwards because we need some room in front of us. We start by grabbing our knee. Grab your knee, pull your knee to your upper body, make yourself tall and then we grab our ankle, bring our heel back, and then we fall into a forward lunge. Bring our arms up to the sky or the ceiling, lean backward, take deep breath in. And by our exhale, we come back, switch the side. Take your knee, pull it to your chest, make yourself tall, and then we switch side. Grab around, bring the heel back, and fall into forward lunge. Bring your arms up, take a deep breath in, lean backwards. And with the exhale, close your feet again. Going back again. Now we're doing the same with a slight rotation in the upper body. We start with our knee. Grab your knee, try to stay stable, make yourself tall again. Grab around, you know what's coming. Your heel comes back, then forward lunge. Here, bring your arms a little bit up. And then with a deep inhale, when the exhale, we go in a rotation left and right come back switch to the knee pull the knee and then grab your ankle into the forward lunge arms up and then the rotation left and right and then bring your feet together shake your feet out shake your arms out last but not least we are taking our arms up very high lean backward take a deep breath in and with the exhale we swing down get a fully mo range of motion in our legs Shake them out and now you're ready for some fast runs, some good paces and the, your next PRs. So have fun with running. <laughs>